What's up guys? July is a huge month for events here in Japan. Because it's summer, there's tons of festivals and also fireworks displays. Two of Japan's top three festivals happen right here in Kansai. First, there's Kyoto's Gion Matsuri and Osaka's Tenjin Matsuri. Both of those festivals I'll talk about a little later. You can check the links below for all the event information and for any events that I don't mention. As always, events occur either on the same dates every year or very close to it. Be sure to check the event information if you are watching this video after 2018. I'll also leave a link to another great festival site called Omatsuri, which is a Japanese festival calendar. July is known as the month of Tanabata, celebrated on July 7th. It's based off of Chinese legend, where two celestial lovers are only able to meet once a year. On this day, people write their wishes on pieces of paper and tie them to bamboo branches. Tokyo's most famous Tanabata festival is the Shitamachi Tanabata Matsuri, held from July 5th to 9th. It takes place on a 1.2 kilometer stretch of road between Ueno and Asakusa. Expect to see food and drink stalls, or yatai in Japanese, dancing and other traditional performances. One Osaka Tanabata event is the Heisei Osaka Legend of the Milky Way on July 7th. The Ogawa River is transformed into the Milky Way with lights to grant people's wishes. The Grand Sumo Tournament takes place in Nagoya from July 8th to 22nd. If you didn't know, sumo isn't a year-round sport and tournaments are few and far between, so take the opportunity to see them when you can. On July 10th, 11th and 14th, the city of Hakata in Fukuoka Prefecture hosts the Hakata Gion Yamasaka Festival. It has a 750 year history and features men pulling one ton wooden floats. The Hiranogo Summer Festival is claimed to be Osaka's largest float festival running from July 11th to 14th. Also in Osaka is the Namba Yasaka Shrine Summer Festival on July 13th. This is an evening procession of 22 boats and 600 people sailing down Dotonburi's iconic canal. The Taikodai Festival is held at Osaka's Kanda Shrine on July 14th and 15th. This is a 270 year old festival that involves nine gorgeous taiko drum floats. As previously mentioned, Kyoto's biggest festival is also one of Japan's top three. The Gion Matsuri is held every year on July 17th with a smaller procession on July 24th. This festival features giant Yamaboko floats pulled by men through the streets of Kyoto City. On the two nights leading up to July 17th is Yoyama Night, where Kyoto closes its central city streets. The streets are then lined with food, drinks and game stalls. I made a video about Gion Matsuri and Yoyama Nights, and that's available up here. Yamaguchi City in Yamaguchi Prefecture also has a Gion Matsuri on July 20th, 24th and 27th. A signature of the Matsuri is the Dance of the Heron, which marks the start of the festival. Up in Sapporo, Hokkaido is the Sapporo Summer Festival, running from July 20th to August 17th. It features traditional bond dance and Japan's largest beer garden. On July 22nd and 23rd, the town of Kiso in Nagano Prefecture holds the Kiso Mikoshi Festival. There are 100 Mikoshi, or portable shrines, involved in the event. What makes this festival special is that these 375 kilo Mikoshi are carried and then flipped over end to end by groups of men. The Tenjin Matsuri is on July 24th and 25th and is Osaka's largest festival. It's in Japan's top three, along with the aforementioned Gion Matsuri in Kyoto and Tokyo's Kanda Matsuri. This event has a 1,000 year history and involves two processions, one on land and one on water. The land portion starts with 3,000 people carrying a portable shrine while wearing Heian period clothing. They then board boats that sail along the Ogawa River. And then at dusk, those boats have fires lit on them to create quite the spectacle. And on the final evening, there's a big fireworks display to close the event. On July 27th in Nagahama Prefecture, there's the Nagahama Kita Biwako Great Fireworks Festival. 10,000 fireworks will be set off over Lake Biwa, and the best vantage point is at Ho Park near Nagahama Station. From July 27th to 29th is the Tobata Gion Yamagasa Festival. Yamagasa floats are carried around the ward of Tobata in Kitakyushu, Fukuoka Prefecture. At night, the floats are adorned with beautiful lanterns. 
Also in Kyushu is the Beppu Fire Sea Festival from July 27th to 29th. The festival includes food and drink stalls, art markets, dancing and music. It closes with Kyushu's biggest fireworks display on its final evening. The Kuwana Suigo Fireworks Festival is held in Kuwana, Mie Prefecture on July 28th. 10,000 fireworks are set off to celebrate the completion of Ise Bridge in 1934. The Nagasaki Port Festival runs from July 28th to 29th. There are fireworks accompanied by music and lasers, entertainment stages, and rowing races. Here's a fun one. The Japan International Birdman Rally runs from July 28th to 29th at Matsubara Beach on Lake Biwa in Hikone. Sea contestants attempt to fly their homemade aircraft off of a giant platform. And finally, Osaka's last summer festival is the Sumiyoshi Matsuri, held from July 30th to August 1st. The highlight of the festival is a procession of women and children wearing Muromachi period clothing whilst walking through a thatched ring. The ring is meant to purify as they wish for good health. The general public are also able to pass through the ring at other times. That's it for July's events. Please leave a comment below which event looks the most interesting to you. My name is Lin Yund. Thank you so much for watching. If you like my content, be sure to hit that like button, consider subscribing, and hit that little notification bell to join the exclusive notification squad. Actually, it's not that exclusive. Anyone can join. And on that note, I'll catch you next time. Shitamachi Tanabata Matsuri. Heisei Legend of the Milky Way. From July 27th to 29th is the Yamaga uh, Tobata Gion Yamagasa Festival.